Hello, this is Lorena, and I'm back with another Deluxe video. In this video, I'm trying to uh, build my way back to another Turbo Duel where Aporia is level 2000 or higher. And now, obviously, the last video was a disaster. Aporia stole my Synchro Monster, and I basically was dead from that point onward. <laughs> and now, to be completely fair, it is surprising that that is the first time that I've had my Sacred Monster stolen from me in this entire event. Yes, surprisingly, that was the first time. And this is the last day of the event. I've got questions. Okay, well, I, I mean, I had questions, but I pretty much... I pretty much have been paying enough attention to assume that probably I would be al I, I'd probably stay alive. I'd probably win. <laughs> Even though I was questioning that person's decision skills, but sure. Okay. No Hotzo is getting pretty close to um, his cart and cap. I am looking forward to maxing out his level. <laughs> and I'm gonna put the monster he gives me at level 2 at level um, 35 in his deck. If that's why I'm doing this, to get that card. And so I can put it in his deck. <laughs> Obviously, that's not going to necessarily fix the problems with how I've constructed his deck. But, I, I mean, I wanted it. I want that card. <laughs> but though it is one of the cards in his deck, so, I mean, it makes sense that I would want it. If I'm going for... If I'm going for... A card if I'm going for a deck that he that he actually uses building gimmick puppets I probably want as many of the good cards in it as possible <laughs> and now this doesn't mean that I would suddenly win with him more often just because I have that card but it would mean I could focus on someone else for a bit I'm not sure who else to focus on um, let me think. Well, I could switch over to Kite. Yes, I could switch over to Kite. Yeah, let's just stay in this world and level up everyone instead of going to any other worlds and maxing out toys there. I, I mean, I, I could, I could. But, I mean, I focused on a world for a long time. We know how long I can just be focused on a single world, and that's it. No other worlds, no, no. I just focus on one. Just one of them. Okay. Well, although we know that I can do that, hopefully I won't be focused on Zexa World forever. <laughs> hopefully. Isn't there an event later that... No, actually, do I even know what I'm talking about? You know, there, there's actually some very hilarious tags that I wanted to go over. <laughs> I, I don't know what, did I think it was funny, and also if I did, why? Uh, do I remember what I was going to say about that text? I don't. Alright, I see, I don't. Fair, I guess. Um... Okay, I see. But this is not good. You know those are going to the graveyard if he if he exceeds summons. Yeah, he exceeds summon. What? No. Okay, sure. Sure. I I'm going to uh I'm going to destroy you. Yeah, the, these guys are going down. Yeah, okay, those monsters are off the field. <laughs> and look at my other one. <laughs> I've completely turned this around. I won. That was amazing. That was so amazing indeed. Okay, so there's a Duelist Kingdom event coming out. 
next and there was something about that notification that I thought was funny what was it is it like a mistake or something I don't know let me look it seems kind of weird that I would think that something is funny in an advance notice but okay dullest other players <laughs> Okay, I see. Attention duelists. Attention duelists. Duelist other players in Pegasus. Oh my god. I know that is just a typo, but seriously. Oh my god. Dude, are they just reusing that text instead of fixing it? Guys, you've had years for this. You've had years for this. I'm pretty sure that's one of the oldest events in the game. I don't even remember if I participated in it, though. I remember an event for, I think, Yami American, an event for Yami Bukura. Yami Bukura is, uh, for some reason, I definitely remember his. I don't really know for sure if I remember one for Yami Merrick or not. But I do remember that I unlocked him at some point in my original file. Obviously, I didn't keep record of that information. So this is just a new account, but better on it, obviously. <laughs> like, I know that I could have saved that information just in case, but why? I, I mean, I had no incentive. I didn't think I was actually going to play the game again after a while, so... I thought it would have been pretty dumb to keep, to keep that information anyway. You know, I thought I would never become a YouTuber either, but that happened. And the main reason I thought I, it, I thought I would never do it was because of how YouTube treats its content creators. Well, that's the main reason. The other reason is I didn't think I'd ever have the guts to actually do it. Which, obviously, I was wrong because, I mean, I've uploaded how many videos at this point? I'm surprised I'm still doing this. It's like a level of commitment I've never seen before. But, I mean, I haven't been editing my videos, so there is that. But, I do, I, I do have to address the elephant in the room. And that's, well, my videos aren't in the best quality. And now I think my, I think my audio is fine. Although sometimes my pronunciations can be, uh, questionable. <laughs> but aside from that, I think that the quality of my videos is... I can improve the quality. But I can't improve the quality of my videos if I don't have better equipment. And I have sacrificed quality in terms of visuals, so I can record these videos and they won't lag. Now, obviously, if I get a better computer, that will be less of a problem. And hopefully my videos will look much better. And now, even with that in mind, my videos aren't going to suddenly become some professional work of art. They aren't going to look like some, um, they aren't going to look polished. They aren't going to become like that. I'm not sure if they'll ever look polished, to be honest. But if that ever does happen, I can guarantee you it will not be this year. And I'm not sure it'll be next year either, but I mean, there are some plans to create other content. Unfortunately, I'm not sure what's actually allowed on this platform. I've seen a lot of content creators dealing with bullshit from YouTube, and I'm just sitting here like, I have no idea how I'm going to do this. I mean, obviously, I've got the guts to actually talk on this platform. You can understand what I'm saying, but... I, I mean, there's a reason that I've stuck to mainly content with Dual Links. However, there is a problem. I'm not really sure how safe these videos are. YouTube could destroy these videos at any point they want. Uh, 
So, I don't know how much of a career I can actually have on this site. No, I use career lightly because I'm not really sure there is a career to be had. But if there is, well, it's definitely going to be difficult trying to get there. I'm just... I just humor the idea of a career on this website because I've seen the dedication that I have to actually uploading videos pretty regularly and the fact that I'm still doing this months later. It shows some promise in terms of being successful on the site and a potential way of perhaps earning money in the future if I become good enough to actually do that. And now that does mean I would have to become more polished in terms of how I create my videos. I'd probably also have to cut back on some of the things that I do now. Like, um... Like, not editing my videos, but... That would definitely, that would definitely still be videos that I don't edit. I mean, come on, how many YouTubers edit their streams? I mean, obviously they're going to edit streams, so there's nothing. Elite. There's nothing against that. Obviously, they are going to make it safe for upload on this site, but obviously, YouTubers are not always successful with that. They try to follow the rules, the rules as well as they can, but YouTube makes it very difficult to actually be sure. That's what you are uploading follows their guidelines. They make it very difficult to know what you can and cannot do on the site. And it leaves me very hesitant when it comes to certain forms of content creation. How do I know that what I am making is safe for the website? How do I know that YouTube allows this content? How do I know that it will be here and YouTube isn't going to just destroy me? I don't. Ever. If they could decide to strike me down at any minute because any number of my videos just get reported. I'm not really sure, but trust me, I think there's- a, I'm sure there are plenty of ways that this could go. So, I missed that I didn't- I, the raid was completed, and I missed that again. So, what is my response? Well, um, where are the, what legendary duelists are roaming about? I, I could get lucky at any point, you know. Okay, I'm currently playing as Taya, apparently. Makes sense. I believe that's the last person I was playing when I did this. I... I think I was doing a mission for her. I think it was leveling up the stage. Yeah, I'm sure that's it. Okay, well, I don't see anyone there. How about in Dark Side of Dimensions? I'm not switching characters. I'm... Um... I'm not seeing anyone here, either. Alright, well, there's no one there. Okay, well, um, Jack's World is next. I think that's fi I think there is someone in 5G's world, because I don't think I've dueled them. Okay. Um, well, l let's go around and see. You know, you'd think I'd know the answer to this, considering I accidentally went to this world. Okay, well, well, there's no one here either. Okay, 5G's world. Yeah, why wouldn't I check the world I was already in? Wait, wait, I was in Zach's world instead. But you know, you know, like, I, I think... Okay, I, I don't see anyone here either. No, wait. Okay, yeah... That's the person I was remembering. Like, I never actually told him. Okay, sure. Um, you say kick his ass for me, please. <laughs> you know, you're not very threatening at level 10, Primo. Just saying. Oh. 
All right, well, I've already won. Okay, that's not true. You know, I actually remember Primo taking my monster instead. Like, I don't- like, I never dueled against Aparia until he was introduced to this game. Like, the current event, and I remember Primo stealing my monster. But was it Primo that took it? That is the question. It could have been any of the three that took it. But obviously, I am blaming Primo for taking it. Even though I have no evidence that he could have taken it. I mean, I could make evidence, but uh, I'd rather not get my secret monsters taken in the first place. Um, sure, you're... Sure, look at how this level 10 is talking to me. Okay, hold on a second. <laughs> Big words. <laughs> okay, um, I, I guess I'm just going to call him a noob. <laughs> Big words. <laughs> okay, well, this is ridiculous, honestly. Um, let me look here for a second. I've got two windows open. Okay, hold on a second. Um... Big words for a new... Yeah, big words for someone that's only level 10. Okay, actually... <laughs> level 10. <laughs> okay, um... If this actual worm is level 10. <laughs> yeah, that's right. This actual worm is level 10. <laughs> Alright, so, um, he's available at 2800. Wow. Okay, well, that's good. At least I'm back to where I was. <laughs> I'm going to end the video here, guys. So, uh, yeah. Since this wraps everything up, I will see you guys in my next video, and hopefully I will kick his ass. <laughs>